strawberry shortcake truffles. They're coming on the menu at Milk Bar here very, wow. very soon. They're basically the sidekick of our strawberry shortcake layer cake. Mm. Also coming in hot on the menu. If you want to know when it's out, you can sign up at MilkBarStore.com. We'll shoot you an email to say it's go time. Um, but these are my favorite what desserts. Do you love, first of all, <laughs> just to get a, a good email or, or, or text, right, that True. just says, the good times are here from the milk bar. We're ready. We're yeah. ready for goodness. <laughs> um, it's also one of my favorite recipes to make at home when you're like, the world needs some goodness today. So <laughs> the recipe is also there for you as well, but I'm going to show you how it's done because you know. Because you're, you're the master. Stop. It's a very easy recipe to put together. So in double R land, which is my favorite right. nickname for you at home, <laughs> um, you can either bake vanilla cake or right. you can buy vanilla cake or honestly you can use that cake that's been like sitting in the fridge that needs a new life. It needs it something to do. It needs, yeah. some, it, needs, it needs an assignment. You basically take the cake, you break it up by hand like this to break it down and then you add a little bit of moisture that also gives flavor so I have some milk and I'm going to add some vanilla extract and some strawberry extract but you could use anything that's flavorful and liquid so no, you should do what she says just do what she says <laughs> no but you could do like if I were at home with my daughter I'd be like a strawberry milk time girlfriend you know what I mean oh. it's, it's whatever is going to bring the flavor story I in. gotcha so you could use Together. vanilla and strawberry you or whatever exactly gotcha. just to give it flavor and perspective anything can be you could do cold brew if you wanted to take a little gotcha. tiramisu page but we're sticking with strawberry shortcake as the flavor story so, so fun you so bring and you can smell it right it oh smells yeah it's like i'm trying to get my hands on some strawberry shortcake perfume. Mm, mm, so mm. you're gonna add just enough until when you scoop a little bit of it it can hold its shape Gotcha. I like to stud it with a little bit of freeze-dried strawberries, which is also part of the flavor story of this you cake You know itself. when you buy the cereal that has the strawberries in it? Yes. That's what she's talking about. You can about. pull it out. I just want to say when you mm -hmm. can't get freeze-dried strawberries at home, pull it out of your cereal, chop it up, and all of a sudden Seriously. you have this. Why not? But basically you take this cake what is now this sort of like cake dough. And I like to scoop it because that gives you nice, even, even consistency. Even, right, right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And then it's basically like meatball land, right? But in sweet I know terms. how to roll a meatball. I know you know how to roll a meatball. So you just give it a nice little rounding from there. This is also like a super fun activity for the kids. For the kids. kids. Right. You got me. From there, you basically get to do, and this is my favorite thing with kids, I call it white chocolate hands. It's melted down white chocolate just till it's a fluid state like this. If you're using like white chocolate chips at home, because I can never get really nice white chocolate, right. you can do a little bit of melted white chocolate chip and a little bit of oil. Gotcha. But basically, someone gets the gloves on, and I know everyone's got gloves at home now. Oh. You can actually get gloves, right? My husband is hypochondriacal. We have about 112 cases. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> well, then you wonder what? You can assign him to white chocolate, where basically you give yourself a spa treatment with white chocolate, and you take- Oh yeah, John's doing in that <laughs> and you do basically you just roll it in the palm of your hand again yep. a nice thin shell and then you pop it over into something that is um, that you can grind down into this sort of like sandy state and it can be anything we use the crumbs from the cake which are strawberry shortcake crumbs Yum. and shortcake crumbs but it could be pretzels it can be that cereal that you're talking about that already right, has right, the strawberries right, right, right. something that just brings you over into sandy land I call this zen garden you know like you're zen raking garden, through like you're doing that rake thing that's it and basically you pop these babes out until they set in full oh and then you get all the way back that's your milk bar version oh my god or we'll send them to you in the mail or you can come visit one of you know i mean you can get them into the world any way shape or form but i think this is a really fun easy project that anybody could do totally i love totally. you i got you you're delicious always oh Guys, be sure to pick up a copy of Christina's new book, Dessert Can Save the World. It is available now. And as she said, look for those alerts. Sign up to the milk bar. Yeah. She's got you.